This is a three-peat. Come on, man. Hold on. Let me change my fit, because I'm uploading this one tomorrow. <laughs> Let's play a game, Big Bang. Take a little break. Let's play a game, Sniper. I got range. She play a game, she hyper. She love cocaine. Oh yeah, I'm in here. <laughs> oh yeah, big Gucci cello. What the hell? What the fuck? I know who I am. Hey, let's get eyes on that, bro. I look. Damn. Damn, come on. What are you doing, though? This, bro, this camera is reversed, so it's like, it's tweaking me out. I'm so dope. <laughs> We got a. Uh, something about cocaine. I ain't, I ain't read it. Oh, yeah. 600 pound cocaine dealer. Too big to fit in the courtroom. He is sentenced from the back of the ambulance. 600 pounds. Let's get it, man. We got information that he was um, a pretty large man, but we didn't, we didn't realize how big he was <laughs> in the house. Um, when and we, we were able to, uh, I guess. When I say large, I'm upwards of five to six hundred pounds. Damn. If you can't get the defendant to court, the court will go to the defendant. That's what happened <laughs> today when a six hundred pound convicted drug dealer was sentenced. Local 12's Angela Ingram shows us how I'm police say Kirk Smith was a menace in his neighborhood. How you six hundred pounds selling drugs? An ambulance. How you doing eating with that money? Of the Hamilton County Courthouse, inside 42 year old Kirk Smith court had to come outside to him and that's where Smith was sentenced for trafficking in cocaine, weapons under disability, and other drug charges. Uh, we received a Crime Stoppers tip and some input from the community that an individual up on Rosewood and Hartwell, um, the activity was consistent with drug trafficking. Cincinnati police got information that Smith was running a drug ring. This is an older mugshot Damn, of him dude. from 2009. When officers oh, the house, they found surveillance cameras, drugs, and guns. They read him his rights, but they could not physically arrest him. It was pretty obvious that he was, uh, there were people running for him um, because he's so large. Like, as I mentioned, six, seven hundred pounds. He baking his ass. He wasn't able to move around freely, so it made he it kind of tough ass. on us to maneuver and or possibly even get him out of the house that particular day. In fact, it was impossible. The <laughs> nigga said it was impossible. From the courthouse directly to prison, he was sentenced to two years behind bars. Police are hoping Only that two years? gives neighbors back their peace of mind. It was pretty evident and obvious to the people that live up there that they, they want what we all want and that's uh they don't want the the activity they don't want the the, the 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 violence that's associated with the drug sales um they just want a, a, a quiet neighborhood just like we all do while smith did plead guilty to the charges his family says he is still a father he is a family man and their priority is He's his children at the hamilton county courthouse angela ingram local 12 news and no word on what Ohio prison could handle a man of that size. <laughs> but they're baking this guy. Was convicted of trafficking marijuana. Bro, they're baking. I'm, trying, I'm, trying, I'm, not, I'm not trying none of that. Damn it. Golly. All right, look. Man, 600 pound dude selling drugs, bro. How do you even... Like they said, though, he, they did, he did have people working for him. But they were baking him in that whole video. He said, what, what president in Ohio is going to find a space for him? Like, what, bro? That's a, you can't say that. I mean, you can't be reported and say that. What the hell? All right, man. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Vest cello in the building. Skinny cello in the building. I'm in the building. Like a freezer, but I'm still hot cause I'm carrying this heat. Catch me in that thing, switching lanes, I'm a creature. I'm a Texas nigga who be asking for a feature. Hey, it's nice to meet ya. Now I'm finna rob ya. I was eating noodles, now a nigga eating lobster. Look me in my eyes, you can tell I am a monster. No remorse, we gon' put your body in the dumpster. Three stars on me like I'm